Hey everybody, David Likens here. Gonna do a quick walk around on one of our Paddle King Low Pro Angler pontoon based fishing boats. This boat is pretty much stock minus a few Paddle King accessories and maybe one little accessory that we've added. But I just wanted to show you, uh, basically we stock them this way where they're pretty much everything standard from the factory. Then as you want them, we'll specifically build your boat for you, whether you want an electric motor or you want a gas motor or you want a front trolling motor. Uh, we'll critique it and make it your own because everybody has different needs and purposes for, uh, for boating. It's a great, great thing to do out in the sun. Makes lots of memories and can be a lot of fun, especially if you're a fisherman and looking for that boat that can float in less than 10 inches of water. This boat is 13 foot 6 inches long from tip to tail. The deck size is 8 foot wide, I'm sorry, 7 foot wide, 8 foot long. So you have a lot of deck area to stand in. Ideally, this boat can fit up to four people, but it is perfect for one person fishing or even two guys uh, wanting just a basic, really simple pontoon boat. Uh, and once again, we can customize it with accessories and things that you want of your own. The boat can use up to a six horsepower gas motor and only weighs 460 pounds. Pretty amazingly light. Uh, it does have four 12 inch diameter pontoons under it. Out of the box, you do get a snap on mooring cover that is not for traveling, but it does look great in protecting your investment. You do get the front standard LED navigational lights. This is the boat cleat that we do install with stainless steel hardware. Uh, that way you can tie off an anchor, tie up to a dock a little simply versus using the gunwale rail. As we walk around the boat, I'll do a quick few features on the outside. This is burgundy and gray, which is a new color for this year. You do also get the standard bimini top, bimini boot, mooring light, and live well. Now, as we look at the back of the boat here, you get a good look at the four pontoons. This is the protecting bracket for the live well pump, which is, pow which is a powered off of your running battery and a switchable to where if you don't want to use it, you just don't turn it on. And then your aluminum transom mount for your motors. You can put an electric motor back here or up to, again, a six horsepower gas. Now, whenever we outfit these uh, for our customers with chargers, we do like to mount in this area here the electric charging motor if they choose to have one that way it's out of the way and can stay dry even though they are all water resistant now going back around the boat and then we'll hop up into the front the other navigational lights and boat cleat the trailer is optional this is a powder coated trailer with the spare mount spare tire and mount it does have a marine grade textured vinyl. Great, great option. The only option which is nice because when it is wet, it still has texture and is not slippery. Now, as we get into the boat on your starboard side here, this is your live well. It does have a, a little safety lock here to keep this set down. Nice size live well. Drain port that comes straight out to drain the water. Adjustable flow spigot for your live well. Now that is the base plate for the Paddle King optional uh, full seat complete, which again, we don't install those until uh, we know our customers want them. This is the optional Paddle King seat cushion. Now on this boat, like most of them that we do sell, we did add the additional storage box with the seat cushion as well. You do get your cup holders and rod holders in both corners or standard Paddle King features. And again, I'm gonna open this one up. It has the same type of lock, it snaps down to keep it shut. So if you're traveling, quite a bit of storage there to put dry goods, life vest, anything like that that you would need. Now, nude for this year, they did change the seats, which are a lot larger, uh, really comfortable. They do fold forward to give you some storage space there to where if you wanted to put a your batteries or more storage, fire extinguisher, anything like that. On the driver's side, which is the rear starboard side, is where the running battery mount is and all the wiring hookups for this boat. Now, as you come down in the front here in front of this seat, this is where Paddle King does mount all of their 
light controls and bilge controls or live oil controls. This is the open bow version of the Low Pro Angler. They do offer a closed bow, which is to the boat here. This one does have the optional half gate. Thank you for watching. If you liked the video, please give us a like. Uh, if you like watching customized videos, we do a lot of different customized boats uh, for our customers and we do ship them anywhere across the United States. Uh, again, my name is David Likens. My name and contact information is below. If there's anything I can do to answer any of your questions or a video or photos that you would like to see, please feel free to give me a call. We'd love the opportunity to work with you. Thanks again for watching.